Well, hello there, Cougars. It is Tuesday, April 23rd. How are you doing today, Mr. Carolyn? Living the dream. Every day with Every me day. is a dream come true for anyone. Join me on announcements. Uh, hey, uh, shout out to our seniors. Nice job last night. Senior rec night was, uh, was a lovely affair. And uh, if you uh, were not there last night, um, you can go to the main office and uh, put your name down on a piece of paper and they will put together a medals packet for you um, over the course of the week and then they will notify you when it's ready. They will not have your medals ready for you there. If you were there last night and you were one of the unfortunate students that did not get a medal uh, due to our uh, negligence, please stop by the office and ask for that and I really apologize uh, for running out of some of the medals. Uh, so uh, stop by the office, they will give you those right away if you were there last night. But if you were not there last night, um, please uh, just fill out the form, uh, write your name on the list and they will take care of you. All right, what else we got going on today? I didn't win anything last night, did I? It's a different kind of senior recognition night. <laughs> oh, oh, is that an old joke? It's just a joke. <laughs> it's just a joke. <laughs> JV2 girls tennis team defeated Jeff last Friday by a score of 6-3. to three. Way to go. Returning a new uh, volleyball athletes, don't forget about the player-parent meeting tonight, Tuesday, April 23rd from 6.30 to 7.30 in the Black Box to learn about summer camps and opportunities for the fall. Seniors, on Wednesday, all seniors who have loaned books, overdue books, lost books, or fines will go to jail. No, uh, will receive notice from the library. All items need to be returned to the library by May 8th. That's in two weeks. All fines and costs for lost, uh, for lost due books need to be paid by May 15th. Thank you. Art lovers, if you created a tie-dye t-shirt last week, Please make sure to pick it up for Mr. Bernard in room 205 by the end of classes today, Tuesday. Importantly, please plan to wear it tomorrow, April 24th, for a quick group picture after school by the art room. Thanks there again. That's nice. People put thank, thank you. you. Yeah, that's nice. Well, it's it's good ma manners. It yeah, kinder Kennedy. Student government is selling JDRF t shirts in honor of Mr. Nice. The shirts will be pink and read. H-hui-ho, which translates until we meet again in Hawaiian. I like that. Proceeds will be donated to the JDRF. Pick up forms uh, in the main office and return them to Mr. B in room 164. Spin, dance, learn, compete, have fun. That's a, right up your alley. Yeah, right. both spinning right. and dancing. Okay. Come be part of the award-winning team. Be a member of Kennedy Color Guard. No experience necessary. You do not have to have previous band experience to be part of the Color Guard. Come, in, <clears throat> come to training clinics in the Kennedy Band Room. When are they, you want to know? I do. Monday, April 29th from 6 to 8. Tuesday, April 30th from 6 to 8. And Wednesday, May 1st from 4 to 6. I may just go try out. I think you just should. prove you wrong. <laughs> they said it couldn't be done, but it was <laughs> done. All right. Seniors, the class of 2019 decision day is right around the corner. The counseling office invites graduating seniors to join us Friday, May 10th, 2019, in the Upper IMC, between 9 and 1, to celebrate you and your future plans. This event will honor graduating seniors who plan to continue their education at college or university, apprenticeship or training programs, enlistment in the military, entrance into the workforce, etc. Decision Day is part of the Iowa College Aid School-Based Course to College Program. Activities include cookies and lemonade. Now I know you're on it. Now you, <laughs> cookies are not technically an activity, but for some of us they are. <laughs> are they? <laughs> All right. And uh, completing, not competing, completing final transcript requests and signing the class of 2019 banner to share your future plans with Cougaland. Plus, so much more. Got to really order before midnight we're, tonight. It was really a lot of fun last night. Last All right. Year, so make sure you come out this, this year. Definitely. Yeah. Wear your college slash university gear for the day and bring your best smile. Photo opportunities will be available. All graduating seniors are welcome. Spring has finally arrived. Not, it doesn't feel like it this morning, though. Mm, Kennedy Band students are selling 10 inch hanging flower baskets and flats of bedding flowers. Mm. Please check Kennedy Band Parents' Facebook page for pictures of flowers being sold. The last day to order is Friday, April 29th, with delivery on Mother's Day weekend. Oh, that's nice. Questions regarding the flower sales may be directed to Kennedy Band Parents at gmail.com, to Valerie Johansson at uh, vjohansson11 at gmail.com. And...
and Kirkwood Community College will be hosting an Ag Day event on Tuesday, May 14th. Is that Ag or AG? Is it Attorney General ag, or Agriculture? Ag, ag, okay. Ag. All right. Just checking. All right. During this visit, students will rotate to different sessions to be introduced to all 12 Ag Science programs at Kirkwood. Lunch will be provided. If you're interested in attending, please register online at a URL that's somewhere on the site. Um, space is limited. If you have any questions, please stop in the counseling office. Very good. Hey, seniors, prom is near, and the uh, sign-up for non-candidate prom guests is now online. Guests must be registered by Friday, this Friday, April 26th, at 3 p.m. That's when the form shuts off. Go to tinyurl.com slash khsprom19 to sign up your non-Kennedy guest. Only one guest is allowed per student. Guests must be at least in the ninth grade, but no older than 20 on the day of prom. Guests and students must have physical IDs to enter the prom. Power school screens will not be accepted as IDs. All dance rules apply. See page 37 of the handbook for those rules. And also, don't forget, your prom tickets cost $25 per person, prom and post-prom, $20 for prom only, $5 for post-prom only, and they will be on sale Thursday and Friday through May 3rd in the cafeteria, uh, I'm sorry, in the foyer during lunch. It is art show season, calling for submissions to Kennedy's end of the year art show. This is a juried exhibit which showcases all types of art. You do not need to be enrolled in an art class to submit. Just grab a form from room 301 or 302, fill it out, attach it to your artwork, and hand it to Miss Ennis or Miss Finley. The show will be held in the band room on May 17th from 6.30 to 8.30 p.m. It's free. There's also lemonade and cookies, cookies. if you're into that kind of activity. It's the magic combo yeah. right there. Check out <laughs> sugar and sugar. Check out the art. Uh, check out the show. Then go see the symphonic rock concert the same night. AP art classes will be hosting the show and be accepting submissions through May third. And the Cougar Food Pantry is open 6:50 a.m. to 7:50 a.m. today, and 2:30 to 4:30 to, uh, as well. Those are on Tuesdays and Fridays. Any student who needs food, kitchen, bathroom supplies, toiletries, welcome to come on down and take advantage of that food pantry. The only thing you need to do is complete a very short form for HACAP and it doesn't even require a signature from a parent, just you. Uh, you can um, stop by in room 56 if you have any questions, stop in the main office. The pantry is located in 56. Birthdays today, happy birthday to Drew Bartles, Lauren Beer, Isaac Binion, Sam Drish, and Emma Marple. Happy birthday to all of you. Activities for today, Girls Varsity Invitational Golf is, the Girls Varsity Golf, is that an Invitational at Hunter's Ridge? That makes more sense. That's this morning. Good luck to them. Uh, hopefully it's not too wet out there. Girls uh, tennis and boys tennis. Uh, the girls are at Hawkeye Tennis and Recreation Complex tonight. Boys are at Kennedy here at home versus Liberty High School. And track and field is at Xavier. That's the girls' invitational. And the boys are there as well this afternoon, uh, both at Xavier. And girls' varsity and boys' varsity soccer. we got a doubleheader tonight, Co College. Come on out, cheer on your Cougs. It's a home meet at our co our little remote satellite stadium over at Co. It's good times out there. And lunch menu for today, we've got it all. We've got a potato bowl. Station one and two. Station three is cookies salad. and lemonade? No cookies and lemonade. No, well, we they don't, don't have it all then, no, do we? No, there's never Well they yeah. have a bottled lemonade. They made a bottle okay. lemonade, yeah. Uh, cookies in there. Station three, salad, subs, parfaits, hot dogs, and breaded chicken. Station four, buffalo and supreme pizza. Station five, nachos with chips, salsa, and refried beans. The alternate is breaded chicken. Cougars, can you believe it? Only have about a month of school left, plus a, bon plus a bonus week that you all earned this winter. So yeah. congratulations on your fine behavior. Uh, we've got uh, just a little bit of school left, and that means you need to be taking advantage of the time that you've got. Get caught up to advance yourself, meet those standards that your teachers are putting out there for you, because we want you to graduate, we want you to be smart, we want you to be capable, so that you can be like the seniors that are gonna be doing decision day, all right? So please take advantage of the time that you've got, use smart time wisely, not foolishly, and most importantly, treat each other with kindness and respect, because that's what it's all about. Everyone have a great day, and as always, Go Kooks!